go to sound trap open up a new project make it a blank project in the middle of the page it says import file so click on import file find that MIDI file that you saved before open that up it gives you three tracks the top one is the melody the second one is the chords the bottom one is the bass line you can change the instruments by clicking on the uh, keyboard over here and picking a new instrument family you don't have to stay with keyboards it can be anything just don't go down here to guitar and bass amps those won't work for this project and make it something that is interesting to you so this is how it came in straight in from hook pad for me so a very keyboard digital it's a Rhodes electric piano sound and not the greatest sound in the world so I changed a lot of instruments went through here auditioned things that I like eventually it turned into this now this track here this these are the chords my melody is up here um, this is the bass line I added drums from the loop section here I added some sweeps and eventually some other things in here it's not finished but <laughs> idea isn't done yet but you get the idea of what can happen when you go from a small hook pad project to a large sound trap file and all this you get through exporting from MIDI from um, hook pad so it's a really powerful simple little program that all you have to do create something export it as MIDI and then import it into sound trap and once you're in Soundtrap, start changing the instruments, um, copying, pasting, putting the song together. Suddenly you've got something much longer and much better. Just don't forget to save. Make sure that you go up and change the name of it and make sure that you save it so that it's ready to go. That's the assignment. Have fun.